A lot of people have been asking about forgiveness, so I figured I'd just jump on and say a few things about forgiveness. Number one, I just wanna say, uh, you have to define forgiveness for yourself because um, if you ask 10 different people what their definition of forgiveness is, you're gonna get 10 different responses. That's number one. Number two, um, ask yourself, what kind of person am I in general? Am I a generally forgiving person? And if I am, then you know it would behoove me to uh, forgive. Forgiveness, keep in mind, does not mean that what somebody did was okay. It just means that you don't wanna be locked in those cha chains anymore of holding this burden that's holding you down, holding you back. Also, um, I, I think it helps with radical acceptance. Radical acceptance doesn't mean I accept what they did fully. What it means was I fully accept I cannot change the past. That's what radical acceptance is. Also, keep in mind, um, forgiveness is for you. It's not for the other person. It doesn't mean the other person did was okay, acceptable, and you're gonna dismiss their wrongdoings. No, it just means, again, I'm gonna forgive you because me holding on to this fire, this coal, this weight is just burning, burdening me down. Also, um, when you define forgiveness for yourself, apply it to yourself. What is forgiveness um, to you? And then forgive. You have to forgive yourself for blur blurred boundaries. You have to forgive yourself for not following through on the pink flags that you maybe saw. Follow through on the red flags that you've never addressed or acknowledged. Um, and also keep in mind there's a difference between um, justice and, and revenge. Try not to seek revenge. Um, for many, many reasons, because you are, you know, hopefully you're a decent person. Um, and so, so you don't want revenge just because you're a, a decent person. Number two, um, getting revenge will neutralize the playing ground and then you lose some feet with um, getting justice. And there's no better um, payment than justice. So try not to focus on revenge, focus on justice. And that doesn't mean justice is in your hands. The person that be, be, betrayed you, the person that committed infidelity or adultery or what have you, um, there will be justice, whether it's financial, physical, spiritual, emotional, mental, you name it, somehow, some way, there will be justice in their life. So, um, you know, again, define forgiveness, then forgive yourself for, for the, you know, the boundaries that maybe you blurred, the red flags, the pink flags that you ignored. Um, then decide, you know what, I'm going to forgive the person because I deserve peace. And uh, lastly, don't get, don't get, get revenge. No, no, let, let, let God, let karma, let the universe get revenge. Um, you do you, you be you, and you make good decisions because you have to lay your head on the pillow at night and love who you are.